Aren't you sick and tired of constantly sharpening your pencil? Yes. Have you had enough of doing artworks with little pencil stumps? Absolutely. Then you, my friend, need a mechanical pencil. Mechanical pencils can come in all different shapes and sizes and can come in metal or plastic. And I'm sure there are other materials that they're made of that I haven't come across yet. The main kind of USP of a mechanical pencil is its ability to hold its fine point because as you can see in this kind of competition between a wooden pencil and a mechanical pencil, the wooden pencil becomes quite blunt after not that much work and needs to be sharpened. As you can see here, a standard kind of sketching pencil won't have a rubber on the end, so you'll need to use a mechanical eraser alongside your standard pencil to get those kind of fine lines, or you could use a kneadable eraser. However, on this mechanical pencil and most other RT mechanical pencils, you'll be able to take off the extender bit and then underneath will be a nice little rubber to use to do those fine details. So in terms of longevity of the pencil, a normal pencil will have around 18 centimeters of graphite, which some of you will actually sharpen away, so you won't actually end up using most of it. However, on this mechanical pencil, alongside the replacement nibs, you've got literally 3.6 meters of graphite to use. So it's a pretty good deal with a mechanical pencil, which is like, 20 times more than the standard wooden pencil. Now mechanical pencils have a fixed nib width so they come in lots of different shot sizes so you've got the 0 0.3, the 0 0.5, 0 0.7 and 0.9 alongside the Chunky Monkey 2mm and the 2mm is used for the 4B and 2B graphite sticks because they're obviously softer so need a bit more structure to make sure they don't break. You can see with this Komodo Dragon that the ability to go really dark with these 2B and 4B chunky pencils and the fine points that they give really helps you to establish those details and achieve that really cool look we are all after. On the topic of breakages, it's really important that with the thinner leads like the 0.3 and 0.5 and just basically all the mechanical pencils that you don't extend the graphite too far up the pencil. The only downside I would say to using these mechanical pencils is its ability to shade. It's more of a sketchy kind of thing because obviously the point is so fine that when you try and sketch, it leaves really harsh lines behind. However, the chunkier one, the two mm lead, is actually quite good at shading because obviously the lead is basically as thick as a normal wooden pencil. So the conclusion to should you use mechanical pencils is yes, because they make you feel pro. And art at the end of the day is a mental thing.